I'm J-Man. And I'm Johnny Love. And we are here to review the Blu-ray release of Lord of the Rings, the trilogy. Yes, here it is. And Boom shakalaka. If you have not seen this trilogy yet, then John and I... We'd like to welcome you to planet Earth. Welcome you back to planet Earth, yes. <laughs> You've um, been living on a rack or under a rack right? or some rack other than Earth. <laughs> right, right. Uh, this, this story obviously follows Frodo, who gets the ring from his uncle Bilbo, and yes. he has to uh, journey all around through Middle Earth for about 11 or 12 months there. Uh, take the ring back to Mordor to destroy it. Classic story. It's been out since the 40s. Author J.R. Tolkien. Yes. Awesome author. Um, we really liked the special effects. We thought they were ramped up in this. I thought they cleaned them up a bit, maybe made them a little lighter in the, in the war scenes so that you can mm -hmm. see a little more detail. Yeah, they weren't perfect, but this no, maybe came perfect. out 10 years ago. Yeah, so. 2001. Yeah. yeah, epic story. You know? Epic story. Epic story. Uh, the sound improvement was tremendous on this. On this, yes. you know, I, I, you know, I enjoyed that. The living room was a shaking. <laughs> they, uh, they, they incorporate the sound with the scope of this movie. On a few scenes, exactly. you see Gandalf ride through, you know, Middle Earth somewhere, Minas Tirith, or, you know, and it, it's just it, it, it draws you into that world and it keeps you there. The story's good enough for you to want to know what happened and, and well, the movie you know, want to too. care about the characters. The movie like, helps yeah. too. I mean, when you read books. Obviously, your imagination takes you wherever. Mm -hmm. But you know what? To actually see what they've done with this trilogy, it's about where my imagination was when I was hey. reading the book. I mean, they were pretty spot on. Very neat. Loved it. Looking forward to The Hobbit. Yep. I know we've mentioned that in a couple re reviews when we've dealt with uh, some J.R.R. Tolkien stuff. Uh, but uh, I'm really looking forward to it. I'd Every month it, it seems like the Hobbit's gonna, you know, it gets pushed back a year, but it's right. coming. It'll, you know, it's gonna take them some time, obviously, but it's coming. But uh, this oh. DVD, or excuse me, Blu-ray, there were uh, a few DVD copies, mm -hmm. and of course yeah, yeah. we had the uh, special effects. Actually, on this. they're digital copies. I'm sorry, well, not DVD. Me. Sorry, it, 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 digital, yeah, digital copy. copies. I gotta get my lingo down. <laughs> I'm, gonna get, I'm gonna get a bad response now in my comment <laughs> section. <laughs> <laughs> what was your favorite character? Oh, Gimli by far. Yeah, he's was Gandalf, he's but, yeah. three feet of badass. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Love loved Gandalf. Gandalf was great. Well, uh, all the characters kept it going. Really yeah, great, and they they know? melt. They they worked really well together. Yeah. You know, Peter Jackson can direct anything as far as I'm concerned. Let him right. let him have a crack at it. And again, special features. I mean, just loaded up. Even video game trailers. All I mean, anything that theatrical has to do trailers. Lord of the trailers, Rings. Yeah. His um, eyes in this uh, Blu-ray. My edition. favorite villain out of this was probably the Nazgul. <sighs> Only I mean, Sauron was cool to watch. You know, he was cool for the clips that he was. In, but the Nazgul really, I thought, were the terrifying demonic well, I mean, badasses that really, you know, they were the ones hunting well, Frodo. You got so. like a winged dragon creature and then the spooky guy yeah. in a black cape. And they scream. I mean, yeah, come yeah. on. You see. <laughs> Movie moments? Movie uh, moments? What was yours? Gosh, there's so many. Yeah. All right. the war scenes, obviously, are great movie moments. Mm -hmm. I mean, you, you like the dialogue between uh, Sam Gollum and Oh, and I Frodo. loved it, dude, when the they were making this cool. <laughs> some <laughs> some <laughs> cool. <laughs> some <laughs> so sweet. You gotta love it. You it's kind of scary, gotta love folks. Gollum. He does, he does <laughs> smeagol so well. Yes, of course. Lust. I like it. Oh, you got, Potatoes! You got <laughs> uh, my, one of my favorite scenes was Gandalf uh, versus the Balrog. I, I, oh, I yeah. love how it's set up here in just a little bit here from the footage we're we're doing on the bridge of Casa Doom, and then you know to follow it up directly into the two towers. I thought that set that movie up greatly. It was, it was awesome, you know. And then Gandalf came back, obviously, from the gray to the white. Epic movie collection. Yeah, you gotta love to, it to just add to the list. I mean, if you don't have this, I mean, this, uh, this is a shizzle. Another yeah. one. I mean, top. Top ten. Oh, yeah. Definitely. I think it's it. I mean, that's greatest yeah. trilogy. Yeah. I think. No, I th see. I'm a Star Wars guy, but no, no, Lord no, of no. the Rings is is right up there. Jamie, man movie meter, I give it a perfect twenty. Star uh, Wars, I'd give a perfect twenty. You cannot compare. I'm space talking, right? to Middle see, Earth. I'm just talking trilogies, man. As, as far as the, yeah. you know, I, I like the whole Star Wars, the first one, of course. The well, first but trilogy, it's a whole this was awesome. another genre. Hey, I'm just saying, I'll everything. play that on Thanksgiving, and then I'll play Star Wars around Christmas time every year. Well, I watch them whenever. <laughs> I don't really care about the holidays. Right, well, there you go. I'll do it on a Monday. Who there cares? You go. Many thanks to Warner Home Video for yes. sending us this. We really appreciate uh, having an opportunity to, to, to view and, and review one of the best trilogies in cinematic history. Right, and to see it cleaned up and sharpened up was nice. Sound yeah. was great, again. Yeah. Uh, we, we just loved worth it. Worth the money. Go, yeah, worth, worth, worth the money. If you're a Lord of the Rings fan, definitely worth, worth the money. Worth the money. And again, fingers crossed. Hobbit's coming. Yeah. That's going to be a very cool story as well. Oh, yeah. And I'm excited. Well, well, again, thanks to Warner Home Video for sending us this. I'm J-Man. And I'm, well, you guys know. <laughs>
We'll see you next time. All right.